Hey guys, what's up? In our three minute game, I'm playing Machine Gun. He's a strong player. He plays like some weird thing. Oh, I thought he did, but I guess not. I feel like he crushed me in some sacrificial line once. But I could be wrong. Let's see, what does he do here? Ah! Uh, hold on, what's the move? I forget. <laughs> um. Castles, right? I think. Oh! I totally didn't mean to do that. Oh, did I? I don't think I did, but now d5 is the move? I'm a little confused. Uh, I think I messed up. Maybe not, though. Find out in a minute. <coughs> he did this to me before. I, get, I don't know why I get confused in this move order. It shouldn't be so confusing, should it be? Alright, what's happening here? Bishop g4, bishop takes, bishop f3. I'm gonna do this. Um, bishop takes or queen take? I'm gonna take with queen. I assume knight c3 probably. Maybe I should just take the silly pawn off. Whatever, I'm gonna take it. I'm a little scared my king's open, obviously. Like this is annoying, right? Let's just defend all my pawns like a wuss. This guy's strong, man. I mean I don't feel great about because here's the thing, lately usually I know all my openings, and this one Obviously, I'm like a little shaky, so I'm gonna get my king out of the way because I'm scared of all these knight checks at some point, like weird knight checks. Admittedly, maybe I should have stopped that, but um, this is going for a cheapo. I can't resist though. Queen f2 is mate. <laughs> uh, he allowed it, right? Boom! Three minute, I like going for cheapos. Bravo, bravo, Greg! <laughs> Guy's a good player, but you know, everyone goes, everyone, there's two games in a row where people have fallen like right into my cheapo attempts. It's kind of, um, kind of good luck. Uh, what the hell is this opening though? It's the second time I think this happened against him. Let's. <laughs> Uh, I mean, what should he do instead? I don't know. Something other than what he did. He thinks it's about relatively close to even the position, though, so I feel okay with that. But did I, like, screw it up somewhere? Like, like for instance, it isn't... Like, why didn't he just take? Like, I don't understand. In this position, do I just take on e4, or what? I mean... I'm gonna go look it up. I mean, maybe this is like the one way to trick me into the opening I don't want to play. Or maybe I can just take on d4. We will find out shortly. I'm looking it up online because this is important. Important information. Because I remember last, I feel like he did this to me before, like, he tricked me in some opening. So in this position, I'm looking on off screen, and castles is, is a pretty rare move, but it is played by some people. Knight takes e4. Okay, so it's just like a totally offbeat move that I've never looked at. And after pawn takes d5, and black has good results here. Basically take, take, and somehow it's good for black. I guess a rookie one f5 or something. Just turn on Houdini just for fun. Queen e2, what, queen d3? Yeah. Rook e1, I assume I take and go f5, or f5 right away. Okay, I mean, the position's fine. <coughs> Am I gonna remember that for the future? I mean, somehow in the game he did some, some weird crap. And, yeah, I mean, my computer thinks I was always fine after he did his, um... After he didn't play D, C takes D4 for some mysterious reason, I was panicking right when I allowed it. I was like, what the hell, Greg? You just let him... I mean, you're just letting him get the center for free. It was, like, obviously bad. But all right, he didn't do it, so... 
You guys like my cheapo though, right? You had to like that. Queen F6. It's easy to miss, you know. <laughs> it looks like a normal looking move, and just all of a sudden. She went maybe h3 or something. I don't know. Anyway, let's see what it says after h3. Oh, I can still take with the bishop, though. Oh, no, I can't. Do I have any tricks here? No. All right. So this would be okay for white. Thinks white's slightly better. But obviously a very playable position for, for both sides. Anyway, um, see y'all next time. Although, let's check my three-minute rating. Number five. That's amazing. I'm number five in both five-minute and three-minute. I have to brag to the world. Which one am I going to get higher in? Uh, the five minutes a few days old. Because, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm a little ahead of the curve in three minutes. Like, this is from, like, four days ago. <coughs> I don't know. If I never lose, it just it keeps going up, right? <laughs> I haven't lost in forever in anything. So, thanks, guys, for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.